This is Mixie's X-ray. She's got a black spot on her brain. That is her brain. Oh. But it's the size of the peanut. Yeah, oh. bigger than we saw. Righto, oh, genius, let's have, have a look at your oh, body. Yes. Oh, oh, she's she's okay. Okay. Oh, Rattus. Oh. Awesome. Oh, looks like a screw loose to me. It's really great of you guys to help me with my end of turn assignment. Oh, oh, it's okay. the most important one of the year. Okay, never mm -hmm. mind, mind. No, this is, is Darren's. Oh. Oh. It's huge. It's empty. <laughs> yep, that's Darren, all right. Oh, yeah. And the last one. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. The last one must be Modigliano. Oh, yeah. oh, I see this. Oh, what a weak pinhead. Wow. Oh, I know. I amaze myself sometimes. Total blank, right? Oh, yeah. come on, Robbie. Show us. You showed everybody else theirs. Here, yeah, get away, peasants. It's my brain, and if there's. <gasps> oh, what is You sure this won't hurt? I promise you, Joe, I won't feel a thing. Why don't I feel reassured? Oh, oh come on. I mean, I mean, who's ever heard of a fatal colander accident? I mean, it's just like having an x-ray, right? Uh, uh, better, better. If it works. If it works. Uh, Joe, sit still, sit still. If it works, right, we'll be able to, like, see inside people's minds. Like, like read their thoughts. Um, a, a mind-reading machine. Yeah. <laughs> You know, Letty, we could make big bucks out of this thing. Uh, we? Uh, sure. Oh, with your invention and my business connections, I mean... Yeah, this... I don't know, I don't know. Hey, I'm taking all the risks here, huh? Yeah, I'll think about it. Okay, ready? And... Come on. You know I wouldn't rip you off. Don't you? And now the moment that the whole world has been waiting for. The winner of this year's Nobel Prize for physics, medicine, chemistry, peace and all-round cleverness. For his brilliant invention, the winner receives these five Nobel statuettes, $100,000, and this Nobel Prize board game, courtesy Games and Things. And the winner is... Lenny? Uh, it's Leonard. What? Sorry, it's Leonard? Oh. This year's winner, Lenny Leonard. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm taking this, if you don't mind. What? That, that's mine. Lenny. Check your contract. I get to keep everything. It's all right there in black and white. Where? Clause 750. Just after the bit about you always doing the washing up. Oh, uh, you're right, Joe. You know, you're always like So, are we in business? No. No, it didn't work. Move out of the way, don't crab her. Give, give her room, Nixie. You choke her paw. Is she, is she dead? Nah, she always smells like that. Oh, how can you be Darren. so happy? Oh, my head. Oh, spare me. Rattus! Oh, come on, a joke's a joke. Cattus, Medigliana is seriously ill. Oh. Gee, I haven't seen her this upset since Tom Cruise married Nicole Kidman. Cattus, oh. don't you realise what's wrong with her? Oh. Look, see? This white line here indicates a substantial fissure between Broca's area and Wernicke's cortex, effectively neutralising the cerebrum, cutting off the cerebellum and rendering the medulla oblongata completely null and void. Come again? I got as far as this white line. Didliana's got such a crack in her brain, she might cark it. Oh. Oh. You reckon she's a goner? Well, I've only been studying the brain for a week. Oh, a second opinion. I want a second opinion. Yeah, we don't want to advertise for a new tenant and then find she's going to pull through. Rattus! Okay, oh. okay. Robbie, do something. Please. Yes, Robbie. You can do it, Robbie. You don't need to be a It'd be a long shot. But... Oh, careful, Robbie. I'm not a well cat. Shh. We're just going to find out what's going on inside your head. Uh, uh, guys, guys, we're getting something.
isn't cat heaven. This is rat hell. Oh, oh, rat ass. No, I had to, Lenny. It was getting too violent. Violent? It was beautiful. <laughs> you don't know what I was going to do with that fan. One more crack and you're out of here, Radis. <laughs> How do you feel, Medigliana? Oh, not too bad. But you never can tell with a critical condition. Oh, come on. Enough is enough. Yes. Yes. Uh, uh, what I mean is that... Oh, forget it. I, I'm out of here. What do we do now, Robbie? I'm not sure, Mixie. It's a miracle. She seems so well. What's a miracle? <laughs> Mendigliana's brain. She's defying all known medical science. But I'm bearing up, Joe. Oh. Yes, yeah, she ought to be dead, but she's not. Thought cats had nine lives. I must have used them all up. <coughs> Until we can find out if there's a cure, Medigliana must have rest. Yes, yes Dr. Dr. Robbie. And above all, no stress. No, no Dr. Robbie. So whatever Robbie. she wants, she gets. Yes, yes Dr. Dr. Robbie. Cream. I'd like some cream. Oh, Mixie, you shouldn't have. Uh, it's nothing, Medigliana. Anything to make you feel better? No, I mean you shouldn't have. I specifically asked for cream, Mixie, but she brought me uh, low fat milk. Yeah, but it's all they had. Oh. oh okay, okay. I'll be right back. And make sure it's full cream, not sour cream, whipped cream, low cow cream, or face cream. Here, Medigliana, I brought my favourite blanket, just like you asked. Good. Now burn it, because we don't want any nasty fleas in here. Do it! Oh, OK. Mixie, sweetie! Fluff up me pillows, refill my hot water bottle and cut my whiskers! <laughs> dear and dear! Fluff up me eyebrows, refill my pillows and trim my toenails! Mixie, darling! Dear and dear! Trim me pillows, fluff up me toenails and comb the hot water bottle! And somebody... Fix that dumb clock! <laughs> Boy, this nursing sure ties you up. She's very sick. Oh, I'm not feeling so good myself. Oh, we have to try. Oh. It's a dog's life, all right. If only Radis hadn't disappeared. Who disappeared? <gasps> I've been busy. You've been hiding. <sighs> then what's this thing? Whoa! I want one! What is it? The Radis Cat Brain Investigator. If we want to fix Medigliana's brain, we have to get inside her skull. Let's go. Radis! You can't use that thing on Medigliana. Maybe. <sighs> but it'll be fun trying. Oh, Darren, there's going to be trouble. <laughs> oh. oh, what? Medigliana, we have to save her. Well, I thought that's what we'd been doing. Come on. <laughs> oh, Marty. Is that you, Rattus? It's opening time. What's that? A present? Heal more. The Radis Cat Brain Investigator. <laughs> what do you think of that? This is a sick room now! What are you clowns... What are you clowns think you're doing? Saving the Digliana. Well, you're welcome to her. I'll be back. I think this is how Lenny did it. The black thing and the red thing, from the brain to the machine. Ah, turn it on. <laughs> it works. <laughs> it might be in here. Come on. Hey, Redis. Keep your voice down. What's she doing now? Look, I'm busy, OK? Get lost. Were well, you trying to open up Robbie's brain, too? Be quiet. I need to know what she... Ah, I mean, uh, I thought Robbie might be dreaming of a cure for Medigliana. Yeah, great idea. Reading somebody's mind is worse than reading their diary. 
clear if we're lucky. <laughs> Why did you scream? What, Leonard, you'll never, ever know. Hi, everybody. Oh. Not one step closer. What did I do? Oh, nothing. Don't worry about it. Hmm, okay. <laughs> hey, um, how come you're so cheerful? I've decided to do a good deed. Well, he's not cheerful. He's insane. I'm going to let Medigliana inside my house. Well, inside my veranda, actually. <laughs> I want to make her last days as comfortable and as peaceful as possible. Uh, yeah, because? <laughs> because I'm her landlord. Mm. And because I'm interested in the welfare of all my tenants. How is she today? Oh, still hanging on. It's a real medical puzzle. The wonder cat who refuses to die, eh? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Oh, whoa, whoa. Hang on, Joe. <laughs> uh, what's in this for you? You know the trouble with you guys? Always thinking about money. <laughs> Oh, I hate it when he does that. Hello? Feline Weekly? How's this for a headline? The wonder cat who refuses to die. Uh, yeah, but it's got everything. Tragedy. Triumph. Love. Loss. And a cute little cat. Darren! You just can't get good help these days. It's a miracle, really. Oh, I feel as frisky as a kitten. I bought some chocolates and a bunch of... Wait! Thank you very much, Darren. You know I'm allergic to... Cat mint. Sorry, Medigliana. And get me some black grapes! Not green ones. I specifically asked for black grapes! The doctor said it's a miracle, she's still alive. We'll come and do a story today. Well, of course it'll be an exclusive. How's the patient today? Not too bad, till you arrived. Well, I can fix everything with this. You've got to be joking. You want people to think you're faking? How dare you! A cat in my unfortunate condition. You want to get better or not? This is a proven herb remedy. Herbs, you say? Mm -hmm. I'll give it a go then. Yeah, Uncle Herbs. It fixed his foot rot problem in a flash. <laughs> oh. See you around. Oh, that rotten rat! When I get my hands on him! Hello, <laughs> Kitty Magazine? How's this for a headline? Miracle Moggy Mocks Mortality. It's got everything. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! Medigliana! Feeling any better today? Oh. Oh. You're looking much better today. Better. Oh, I'm dying, Mixie. Oh. Sorry, Medigliana. I'm lying here at this door getting weaker by the minute. My whole life flashing past me in fast forward. And all you can say is, oh, I'm sorry. Well, no. There's something else. Oh, I should hope so. When you die, can I have your hair dryer? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> Thanks, Medigliana. It's gotta be here somewhere. It's gotta be. Where is it? Where is it? <sighs> Leonard? Leonard, you here? Brett. I suppose you're wondering. Fancy dress night? Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. I'm going as Rat Man. Now listen, Needle Nose. This is the second time I've caught you hanging around here. Now what are you up to? Um, uh, well, uh, I was looking for my x-ray. Yeah, that's it. Why? Well, if you had a brain like that, you'd want a photo of it, wouldn't you? Uh, 
Well, it's gone. Gone. Gone where? To uni. Leonard's probably handing it in for me right now. You didn't. I have probably discovered a totally new disease. Can you imagine what they're going to say when they see Medigliana's x-ray? Yeah, I can, actually. Well, I'd better be off. Sorry, Robbie. The um, the office was closed when I got there. That's just as well. I've got something I want to add to the report. Oh, oh no! Oh, wait a minute. I've got to get a call. There you go. Oh, yuck. I don't believe it. What? It's gone. Hey. White paint. Well, who would do a dirty trick like that? <laughs> yeah, but how can we be sure? As a med student, I've had to look at some pretty revolting sights. But I think this will take the cake. Yeah, well, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Ouch. Hold on to your stomach. Here we go. It's worse than I thought. Uh, this is one weird rat. Golly, Jane. Our lives are so miserable here in Edwardian London. I do hope a special nanny answers our advertisement. So do I, Michael. So do I. Hi, kids. Oh, me, Poppins. You're cutting out keys for help. You're here. You've come to look after us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what'll it be today, kids? Jumping in and out of paintings? A tea party on the ceiling? Flying a kite with your old man? No, nothing like that. Well, what do you want me to help you with? Rambo Cat! Rambo Cat? I'm your worst nightmare. I really must stop eating bad cheese before a nap. Mary Poppins, what are you going to do? What oh, are you going to do? What are we going to do about him? He'll get his. <sighs> Just wait on Medigliana hears about this. At least she'll be relieved. Relieved? Hmm. I wonder. You ready for those advertising photos? Yes, yes, yes. Again, again. Beautiful. This must be the place. Now, I'm at camera left, I think, darling. Up here, oh, find your posse over there. Hi, oh, you're Medigliana. So glad you could make it. Bring it, bring it. Thanks, Pierre. This is 
Mandy Matthews, and we're reporting from the bedside of one of the bravest little kittens in the world, Modigliana. And how are you feeling today, Modigliana? Oh, well, oh, Modigliana is just hanging in there, Mandy. Her condition hasn't changed at all since she was first diagnosed with this amazing condition. This is my interview. Well, I'm the manager. Oh, uh, and Modigliana, how are your spirits? Well, 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 actually, Modigliana's spirits are quite high now that she's launched her exciting new range of Modigliana merchandising. <laughs> And to all those kind people who have sent in cards and flowers. Hey, kid! Don't touch the fur ball. Fish. And every dollar spent on these quality items goes straight. Yeah. You're spoiling everything! Oh. Well, Dickly, Anna, is there anything you would like to ask the viewers to do to help? <laughs> Yes, uh, Medigliana would like all her loyal well-wishers to buy, purchase, acquire, hire, or lease any or all of these wonderful commemorative Medigliana tokens. Oh, Joe. Clear off, I'm coming to my big finish. She could be anybody's cat. She could be your cat. Joe. Snatched in the prime of life uh, by some ghastly, horrible, mysterious illness that knows no cure. Joe, there's nothing wrong with her. Uh, she's not going to die. What? It's a miracle! She's saved! Thanks to the healing power of these amazing trinkets! No! Ratchis faked the x-ray. Oh, that's it! Everybody, there's a dog that can sing like Billy Ray Cyrus across the other side of town. Come on, let's uh, go. No, Man Mandy! Mandy. I, 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 I can sing like Billy Ray Cyrus too! Mandy! Mandy! Mandy. Mandy. We want Ratchis! Oh, okay, just hang on to that. Okay. So, by connecting you up to the brain projector too, you can take part in Radis's dream. Mm -hmm. But you control it. Mm -hmm. You better believe it. Okay. Sweet dreams. Goodbye, kids. Goodbye. You'll never have to worry about Medigliana while I'm around. Goodbye, Mary Poppins. Goodbye. Uh-oh. Oh, I hate Chase Nightmares. There's only two nightmares I hate more. Dreaming that I'm... Naked. Dreaming that I'm falling. Rattus. <gasps> Hello, Rattus. Matigliana. You know? Yes. And you know what I'm gonna do? Oh no. No, no, not the fan. No, anything but the fan. Oh, 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 it's only a dream. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Uh, uh, now, look, guys. Uh, I can explain. What a bet! Uh, it never really happened. Uh, it was all a bad dream. Uh, you'll wake up soon. We woke up to you a long time ago. Hey, you wouldn't hurt your old mate. Not very much, anyway. Oh, no. No, no, not the fan. Anything but the fan. Help! There's a rat called Radis. He's the leader of the bunch. A cat called Mavigliana. She's fluffy, but she's tough. Jeremy's a dopey dog Lixie's a mother that mixed up bunny Barrels That's the barrels for ya Barrels Don't mess with the barrels The barrels They're gonna get you that's the barrels Ugh.